Okay, so we're um, we're down at the target end now. Um, what we've got, if you look to my left here, we've got a 105 artillery shell. Um, it's been fired, I can see that by the driving band, um, and it's blind in this position, so the fuse is in an armed, um, armed state. And because um, we're assessing it's close to critical infrastructure or um, civilian infrastructure that we don't want to damage, we're going to attempt a alternative technique, um, a fuse removal, and we're going to use um, the tecton that I showed you earlier. Um, now what I've done is uh, I've cleared around the shell carefully, um, very carefully around the fuse, use a paintbrush to remove all the um, earth and that from around the shell. And then what I've done is if, if you look this side, I've cleared this area behind the shell as well, behind the fuse, and that's for the fuse to move into. So hopefully what we should be able to do is knock the fuse off, that'll move into the area and hit the sandbag there and this shell, because I haven't excavated this part there, should uh, hopefully stay in position, okay? And then I'm possessing those sandbags behind to catch the fuse. Okay, the placement I'm gonna go for is like that. And what I'm aiming to do is to hit the fuse and not the shell. So on this line here, um, just take the plate and hit this area there. And then what it should do is remove that fuse and uh, deposit it in this area here against the sandbag. Okay, I'll get the uh, charge up. Place it against the fuse. <clears throat> Okay, I've just done a little bit of excavation to find this, but um, you can see the fuse has been smacked um, there along the edge there, and it's, it's um, torn it out. Normally what it'd do, um, normally what it does, it breaks it off along that level there, and it leaves the gain part of the fuse in the shell, but in this case, it's ripped it and torn, uh, torn the whole piece out. Um, so that's there, the fuse, you can see that, like as you can see the damage there and the bending there, that would now, um, need to be destroyed in position or if it was going to be moved you'd need to move that um, semi-remotely or remotely using hook and lines um, to move that but I would be inclined to destroy to not touch that at all and just destroy that in this position. The artillery shell is obviously completely different and um, we can uh, we're happy to move that now we know we can see the gain and all the fuse the entire fuse has been removed and we'll be happy to move that um, and take this to position and destroy this um, destroy this at a leisure if you like in a position that's not going to cause any damage to any critical infrastructure. 